Welcome to another mega exciting five and auto parrying. Let's play this uh, Raptor variation F94. Just a surprise weapon against Thomas. Thomas? So try and play this Raptor variation. Is he going to play 94 though? That's, that's one question. <clears throat> Okay, let's just do this then. I'll protect that. Oh, um, okay, I want to play Bishop D3. Yes, it's going to be annoying. Yes, I can take knight d2. Maybe that's okay. I'm not losing a piece just yet. Interesting. Knight d2. Like, yeah, okay. Um, what does he do about e4 here? Okay, then surely there's bishop c4. This looks. It should be pretty comfortable. Bishop c4. How's he going to castle? Haven't I got castles and they're free coming up? Um, okay, C3 here. Uh, oh. Okay. F3 coming up. I don't think he's got bishop d4 sack just yet. This looks pretty good. Ahem. Whoa! I suspect major improvisation here. Queen d5 looks extremely tempting. Oh, so to me, I think I'm going to play it. Knight e4 takes, rook takes, takes queen f7. Knight e4 looks crushing for knight d6. It really does look crushing for knight d6. Let's play it. <laughs> Oh blow me takes takes just removing the defender really. This I think he's in a difficult position here. My good friend Thomas Tallis, I've played him quite a few times. I think he's uh I don't know him in real life, I'm just saying I played him quite a few times in the ACC, but this is uh, looks like one of the more at the moment one of the more disastrous openings by him improvising. <clears throat> Well, there's queen takes e5 check here. Um, anything stronger? Hmm, it seems pretty strong actually. Because then d takes actually for rook d1 later. Check. Bishop e6 take here. So I'm going to just play d takes hitting his queen. So his knight's pinned. I was going to play the check on rook d6. It looks pretty tasty to me. Check. Right now, knight takes or rook d6. Queen e4. It's bishop f6 after. I'm at root d7. Okay, knight takes. After root d7, root d1. Bishop e6. That looks crushing as well. It all looks pretty crushing. <laughs> rook takes d7. Looks pretty crushing. Like Julian Hodgson type slaughter move. Check. Um, because my rooks are kind of more active than his. Mind you, the last time I did an exchange, so it sort of backfired. But here. It really looks good <laughs> just to blast them through the center. Queen e7, knight f6. Uh, 
Um, king takes root d1, king c8, bishop e6. And isn't that knight f6 there anyway? <clears throat> Hmm. Okay. All right, I think the check, check for bishop e6 here. Check. As he has to give up his queen simply, isn't he? Nope. Okay, queen g7, queen e6. Anything stronger? Rook takes. Bishop takes. Rook d8, double check. King c7, okay. Bishop d7, queen g7. Hmm. This is knight d6 check here for queen takes g7. Isn't that simple and strong? Check. Queen takes g7 just to get this position first. I'm short on time against them inside. Okay, let's not panic. Ice cool, ice cool, <laughs> ice cool strategy that I've been mentioning recently. All right, if I'm ice cool about this, what would be good here? This looks crushing, but I need some knockout blows here. I can take this first. Check. Maybe just B4 for a moment. He's not going anywhere, is he? With this uh, pin. I've got King B8, Queen E7. What is Queen E7? Oh, he's resigned here. Cool, cool. Yeah, yeah. I think Knight E4 was a crushing move. Yeah, he had to improvise um, badly. Right, some inspiration from the notable games recently. The uh, Bishop G5 line seems to be really cool here. Yeah, Queen E5 strong. Knight E4. Yeah, I play the top engine move here. I don't get done for using engines. I haven't used an engine, honest. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Check. Oh dear. Check. Bishop e6 was apparently good. This is good as well. Check. All oh, right. Knight d6 Check. is waiting six. I've let him escape. Check. Well, this is okay. Check. Yeah. Okay. I mean, this. Okay. Let's just see the, the mates. Knight d6. Check. Just out of interest. Oh, knight e8 check. check. Bishop e6, check. yes. Rook takes d7. Oh, it's covering um, c7 now. So this, there's rook d8 checkmate. checkmate. Okay, let's go back earlier. The other possibilities. All right, this is this is this is uh, a slightly yeah. It's it's just a winning position anyway. Knight e4 is a crunching move for rook takes and queen f7. Yeah. Check. Check. So bishop e6 Check. is better. Yeah, what does he do after bishop e6? We're simple and strong, isn't it? Here, yeah. bishop takes. Check. It's murder. Check. 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 Knight d6 Check. is good. Why is that mate there? Check. Do we just look at this? Oh, yes. Check. Looks, looks familiar. Check. Okay, okay. Um, so the rook takes d7. All right. Uh, yeah. Comments or questions on YouTube. Fun one. Thanks very much.